Well, Moses, the Lloyd Minster Baker Hughes Bobcats are preparing for the AMHL showcase this weekend in Strathmore. Yeah, you know, a great time for them uh, as well. The club has had some great success early on, but they've struggled mm -hmm. a little bit putting the puck in the net recently. And they're kind of hoping to keep that goal scoring or at least revive that goal scoring this weekend. Emmett Murphy has more. The Baker Hughes Bobcats are just a point out of their division lead, haven't lost consecutive games all year, and are hoping for four points in Strathmore. I think uh, as long as we keep doing what we're doing, work hard, then we should get these wins. A lot of the club's success can be traced to goaltenders Josh Bukowski and Cade Spencer, who have led the team to the second best goals against average in the league. I just try to keep my cool, don't get riled up over everything, and just go out there and do my job, try to help my team win the game. The team has struggled offensively though, sitting tied for 12th in the 18-team league in goal scoring. Oh, I hear the players all the time, they want to score their goals. and. I'm just telling, telling them not to miss a net in practice and, you know, they'll score goals. The scoring troubles have been compounded with forward Zach Sylvester and Andrew Kapp still out with injuries. Leading goal scorer Tyler Bush will also be out for one game due to suspension. Well, you know, we, 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 don't, we didn't score a lot of goals when they were in the lineup and we've scored probably more since they've been out. Uh, you know, we're trying to make that perfect shot. I think if guys just, I told them, close your eyes and shoot just quick. Uh, it's a lot harder for that goaltender to stop it if it's on your stick and off it right away rather than you getting it and stick handling and trying to make that perfect shot. The Cats face Lethbridge Saturday and the South's worst team, Southeast, on Sunday. Emmett Murphy, New Cap Sports. Let's move closer to home. The Lakeland Rustlers men's volleyball team will look to bounce back this weekend after dropping their season opener, or opener rather. And in this week's Superstar Next Door, Matt Schumont reports on one man leading the charge, third year, Braden Harder. Brady Harder has been playing volleyball since he was a kid. After watching a couple games, he really loved the hype of the sport. I've always seen the sport and just thought it was really cool, fast-paced, intense. See the big digs, big bounces, pretty interesting. At five foot seven, Brady is one of the smaller players on the court, but has developed into one of the best in the conference when it comes to playing defense. Defensively, he's uh, one of the best in our in our conference. Uh, his first contact is great off serve receive uh, and brings energy to the floor and leads by example for these guys. Uh, couldn't, couldn't ask for uh, anything better uh, from Brady. Now in his third year, Brady has taken the role as team captain, looking to guide the team to the playoffs and possibly win an ACAC championship. Since Brady got here, he's been wanting to lead this team ever, ever since his first year. Uh, and this is his year. He's wanted it so bad, so uh, he is our team captain. As team captain, I'm trying to just be really positive with the team and lead the rookies in a way that's positive with everything and in a good general direction and try to make an example on the court for the team. Matt Schumont, New Cap Sports. Superstar Next Door is brought to you by your local BRP dealers, Power Merchants of St. Paul, North Sask of North Battleford, and Rack Tech Power Products of Lloydminster. That's all the time we have for sports. Stay tuned for more New Cap news and weather after the break.